control to Major Tom. How's the burger doing today? It's gonna be good. It's a sick pink. This one. 11 1 2023 and today we're reviewing the curb burger 1517 reviews of total 4.8 stars um, the reason we decided to take the chance to review this burger is that we saw the machine that makes the dough for the bread which means the place makes their own bread which is a very good sign and then we asked a local friend which is Hui about if it's a good place and he said it's the best place in Portugal not only in Porto so it is the day especially after 10k run and losing all the fat today it's time for some fries and some cola um, good stuff coming and another another banger about this place is that it is only two minutes walk from our stay here in Porto now um, mixed reviews not really it's 4.8 again it's a lot of people talking about it is a uh, super place um, I really like I really like how uh, the papers are looking give me a, a sense of five guys maybe What really sucks about Porto is that traffic lights for people do not have sensors. So every time you gotta wait exactly for two and a half minutes. Or you can get lost. The restaurant sign <laughs> and it is as small as an A4 maybe a 3 paper and I don't think it should get any bigger than that I mean it's good enough and what's surprisingly super cool about the menu is that it is a very limited menu they have two types of burgers the cheeseburger and the curb burger and the difference between the two is that the curb burger which is the classic burger has lettuce and tomatoes that's all more than the cheeseburger has and both burgers you can take them in doubles so this is the only items on the menu and this tells you a little too much about a place that does one thing and does it very well do you have a cola? Yeah, we do have Okay, one cola drinks. please. One cola. They selling the fucking cola for two euros. For God's sake. Two car burgers, one fries with secret sauce and one cola. Uh-huh. Yes? Yes. Your total is twenty-two seventy-five please. The waiting time was exactly, not exactly, but it was approximately like seven minutes, which is sick for this place. The lady inside also told us that they closed for sittings for the moment because they're doing restoration. And one interesting thing they mentioned is that they have a limited supply of burgers per day because they get uh, fresh meat every day and they make their own bread. So they ran out of it. They can run out of it um in the day they open midday till 10 at night at the moment and uh santa came early let's see what do we have here all right guys we ordered two burgers uh one fries and one cola and we're gonna talk a little bit now about the price um the price for one burger the classic burger the usual burger is nine euros the fries are 2.5 and they are skin on fries. Very interesting. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Super. It's very salty and I love it. Um, the secret sauce as well comes for free with the fries for 2.5 euros. So this is the normal structure of a classic burger. It is uh, one piece of lettuce, one slice of tomato, a burger, a uh, beef patty, uh, cheddar cheese that's completely melted and onions for sure onions are not caramelized that's fine I like them and the secret sauce of course and without further ado good size maybe 120 grams maybe more of meat let's go 
This bun is a milk brioche bun. I mean, it is amazing. Oh my god. The meat is not very well done, which is super. A little bit, a little bit of red color uh, in the middle. Amazing and uh, super fresh. A burger is not a pasta. You cannot compensate one ingredient over the other to make an overall good tasting dish. Every piece of ingredients in a burger should stand out. And this is what's happening here. <laughs> That's why. Double curve? Yes, please. Double classic burger for the second round and 4.8 stars over 1517 reviews ladies and gentlemen Skirp Burgers is properly represented stacks over stacks of happiness the colors oh my god oh my goodness okay here we go the double classic <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Super good. Oh. And definitely requires a cola. I don't want this fucking straw. I'm gonna throw it. Don't keep your trash on the street. I mean the first two is uh, 